All right, guys, welcome back to uh, Terror Time for Massacre Month. We're playing more D. We forgot something. Um, yes, I am using a guide for this, I know. Try not to take up too much time because this game is, you know, is on a time crunch. And I'm already 15 minutes in, so I'm going to try my best not to take up too much time. I'm going to take up too, too much time. Let's go back up here. There's something we wanted to check out in the fireplace, so let's go ahead and go in. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. Let's go take a look. I may go over, um, past October because of how I hadn't, um, done enough videos. Let's go over to the fireplace, and I believe... There should be a key right here. Oh, hey, what do you know? It's a motherfucking key. Well, she's in a short skirt and a long jacket. Literally. Okay, so now that we've got that, let's go back. Let's turn back over towards the door. Sick painting, bro. Let's really get a look at this painting right at the tits. All right. Now that we've done that, let's go back downstairs and... Um, Fucking, you know, do this shit. So, so originally this game was split into, I think, four discs, three or four discs, and um, it's mostly because the entire game is a giant cutscene. So, yeah. I really, really, really wanted to get this for Saturn, but. Uh, you know, beggars can't be choosers, right? So, um, I'm okay with... I'm glad that it's on PC, that it's readily available. So, let's see. Okay. So, let's see. Let's go over to the water bowl here. Uh, is that going to make me walk all the fucking way over here? Okay, here we go. Oh, it's red. That's good. Um, so let's see. Let's go to our inventory. Uh, how do we use an item in this game? How do we... So yeah, I did that. And time to figure out which button. Brings up the inventory. Oh! Oh! It was like W or something. Okay, let's do that. It's gonna reveal something. Hmm. Four to two. Hmm. That seems familiar, don't it? Well, we got what we needed here. So let's go ahead and go back up to that room. Laura. What's this? Laura. Oh, someone's talking to us. Laura. Laura. This is your father. Oh, fuck. Laura, go back. You must not cross over to this side. This is another world born of my own mind. Laura, go back. 
come further and your world will be closed off from you. Laura, I'm... So apparently, by the way, fun fact, did you know that in the Japanese version of the game, there was no voice acting? It was something that was completely made for the version in North America. That was a categorous reference. I hope you like that. Alright, let's go back up to the study. And let's, uh, let's see, let's do that 4-2. Alright. Back into the study we go. Alright. Okay, so... Hmm. Four? Ain't really nothing there. And two. Oh, hey! That wasn't there before. We got another item. All right then. So let's go back downstairs. That's probably gonna work with the, with the fucking wine thing. Ugh. Pardon my French. All right. Okay, so, this probably goes on the tap of the thing. Okay, well, let's go back over to the dining room. Was it in that door? Oh no, that door didn't open. Can't remember if that door fucking opened or not. Hey guys. What's up, bro? Just playing a spooky game. You sit in the dark? Yeah, I was. Yeah. How are you doing? Playing D. Alright, well that didn't work. We tried connecting it to items. You're gonna Fuck have to restore man. the PC. Fuck you, man. <laughs> oh, come on. Uh, let's see. If you wanna go this way. No, it fucking leads out. I don't wanna go that way. Bunch of big shit balls. That's not where I wanna go. Thing? Okay, so... And... Where the fuck was that? Oh, he was over here. Alright. Okay. What is this? What? It's D. Huh? D. I don't know what that just is. D? It's just D. It's, it's pronounced Dizzle. Get in. It's, a, it's a horror game made in like 1997. Okay. Oh, that's old. So, okay. So, I can't remember what fucking button brings up the inventory. Have you tried? Uh, you already made that joke. Have you tried turning it on and off? 
Have you tried putting the corkscrew into the thing that the corkscrew is supposed to be put in? The only good fucking horror games in like 1997 were like Phantasmagoria and shit. Yeah, I'm not thinking about horror games so, in 1997, I guess. Like, I, you should check out fucking Phantasmagoria. This was made by when like... Was, when, was Resident Evil, when was Resident Evil 1? Like this was made by Warp 1999, Games. 1999, something like that. So like later than that. Okay. There's this dude. His yeah, name. Like, no shit. Like, his name's Kenji Anno. That's probably the first horror game that I can recall playing. It's Resident Evil One. Uh, fuck. There's something over here. Hold on. Move back. That retracted the fucking spikes. So this guy Kenji Anno, he was like a like a entertainer and a musician, and he's like, I want to make fucking video games. Why did your character walk like he has cerebral palsy? Because the entire game's a cutscene. Oh, this okay. game used to be on three discs, oh, really? like three CDs, but they put it on Steam last year, and I was like, "Holy!" You fuck. know that's the best of all the palsies, though, right? <laughs> the cerebral one. <laughs> <laughs> of course, it's, it's, I'm just giving you the facts, Clayton. <laughs> have you, have you are, like have you seen that guy who um he got his own like show from Oprah? He's, he's got cerebral palsy. He's, he's a comedian. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. No, that guy. Like, that's yeah. where I got that joke from. Yeah, yeah. I stole that one. Yeah, I stole yeah. It. I'm telling you. I love like you know like where like he's he's like today I'm gonna exercise and I'm gonna run on the treadmill and he's like trying to like he gets on the treadmill and it okay. starts going and he's just like oh there goes my leg it's okay it's only the left leg like, it's like, I don't all right know. well apparently he, he keeps it real man like. Can I fucking go in here? Put your dick in there. See if it works. I'm a lady, though. I don't... But you just gotta put your clay. Right. You does my fucking... Yeah. Does yeah. my key work? There is a porn yeah, category just like for this. That. Like, imagine, like, your shoulder here is a clit, so okay, you just gotta, like, stimulate work. it real quick. It doesn't fucking work. Okay, you so stimulate, stimulate it, and then it gets, like, a little hard. It's basically like a little tiny little penis. You know? Okay, okay well, cute, that didn't work. Cute little clit. Cute little lick. Let's turn the fuck around, then, and get out of here. I'm going back so I guess stairs. I gotta go back in the fucking dining room. I've already seen some ghosts and shit. This game's kind of spooky. So is this, is this like a Halloween spook? What is this? Well, I've been wanting to play this all month, but I haven't played it yet till now. So I've been getting some spooks on. There's only like three buttons in this whole game. Move forward, move backward, and then like... Space bar. Your asshole? Is that one of them? Uh, maybe. I but know. I want to do that! <laughs> I want to see I mean, inside my own ass, man. I mean, you guys can if you want. Ten points if you find the prostate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Endoscoping is no fucking joke, dude. Like, um, well, they do it for digestive problems, right? But they do it the other Yo, thing. you ever heard of sounding? <laughs> You're talking about sounding. No way. <laughs> no. Is it like ultrasound? No. Nah. Oh my oh. god! Okay. I, don't, I don't know what you're talking about. This is like my childhood. Like, okay. Oh, fuck. Yeah, sounding. Okay, you get like these kits online, okay? You get. Oh my you god. Get, you, you don't even need fucking kits. You, you, cuss, of course you do. Come on. You don't want. You gotta be safe. Oh, I gotta use a fucking ring. You don't want to stick a battery up there, you know? You gotta, you gotta get a. So, can the lock ideally, up. what you wanna do is you wanna get your special lady friend of you together, okay? And you want to get your special fucking lady friend of you. You want to you want to buy a sounding kit on. Like, I love that you're Amazon. fucking talking about this. It's great. Okay. So what you do then is you take the sounding kit and it's got like a little rod in it. Right. And there's different like thicknesses and stuff <laughs> like that. So like different, you know, and it kind of like vibrates a little bit with the thing you put in it. And you, you, your lady friend of you, you get together and she, she like, you get hard and she like just sticks it down your urethra. Like all the fucking way. <laughs> the you're like, oh, wow. Right away, you're just like, whoa. Oh, no. So hold yeah. on. So what it does is it like stimulates like the top of your prostate. So like you come like what? instantly. You just you just bust. You just no bust. Way. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no. Let me tell you something. You know okay? how hard it is to get things in there? Like, I mean, it's, oh, it's, it's easy, dude. That's why it's fucking when called was, sounding. When I was in, when I was like seven, okay, I was playing, I was playing. Uh, Are you gonna tell me a story about how someone stuck something up your dick? When you're no, I stuck something on my here. dick for like a year because I had a catheter in. So. I was, yeah, yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Is catheters like are like basically the same thing, but people, like you people go down further. So you sedated to have catheters. Like, no, no, no. It, once you do it like twice, it's easy. What have you been doing with your wait? What, so what, why have you had catheters? So when, when I was doing? like in grade in grade, I, I was like in grade two. I was playing. I was playing lacrosse with my neighbor, 
and we were playing with just straight up Indian rubber ball. And I used to love lacrosse. I played goalie and shit when I was a kid. And we were just fucking throwing that thing and fucking hucking it. And then he does like a shitty bounce pass that I couldn't stop. And it just went right into the pills, man. Like, just square. Like You're going to be, you have catheters? It it got so swollen, like, my parents took me to hospital. And I had to get a catheter in for, like... The first three months, they were like, you need oh it. God, and then after that, they're like, you don't need it, but it would be a good idea to do that for another, like, seven months. So, okay. for almost a year, I had a catheter in. And so, I was, at one what? point, no, I was wait, just, what? I know, straight a up. year? Yeah. What do you mean? Like, I was like, well, it did, it did serious damage to my dick. Like, it did serious, like. <laughs> that is not a sentence I ever want to hear. Fuck. Um, yeah. No, it so, was. Okay, okay, clarify. Okay, like, hang on. Hang on. You had to have a catheter in, like. So I could piss, yeah. Or my shit would explode. Like, okay, so like you you did it only when you had to piss, or did you just have it in constant? No, you just had whenever you piss. You whenever just, you piss, you just like... You you literally a take... Yeah, you take a catheter, you just slide it in there. No. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta hit the basic... You gotta hit the base of your what bladder. What was wrong with you? What happened? Um, it, the, I, the my swelling... My mom's a doctor, and I'm going to text her So this, the swelling okay? wasn't like, the only thing. Explain this to it me. It actually please, like cause... ripped the, the fucking like actual hole there. So it healed at one point, but they didn't want it to heal to where it like sealed shut. So I had to put the catheter in consistently to keep it open. Oh my god! And they were like, after three months, they were like, "It's probably gonna be okay." But to be on the safe side, just keep doing it. And it got to the point where like I like dude like Tozer. Can you imagine if that was just a joke? I'm not joking. <laughs> I'm dead fucking serious. I, I I get it. Like I mean, like I understand that. Like you put a catheter in for months on end. Try sixty nine. Try sixty nine. No, I know the answer. It's the, the what was on the fucking door. It's seventy eight. Why the? Listen, I my mom's a doctor. What what the fuck was happening? Let me. So let me consult like they, a professional. I don't know. Yeah. Listen, I don't know all the medical terms. I was pretty young at the time, but essentially, like and she is a my mom is like an extraordinarily good doctor, and she is very well respected through. All yeah, no, no, I, I'm, like, I'm dead serious though. It's really happened to you, man. Let me let so, me ask her if they were playing a joke on you. Right? No, 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 straight up. So. Um, I don't Got know it. specifically like the medical terms. There's but, a like, fucking hand in there. Oh shit! Like your dick was just permanently altered or something. No, no, no like, it's fine now. No, it's it's cool now. It's healed, but like the does your the, dick work, man? Like no, no, it's, it's great. Oh, uh, it works good. Tell the uh, ladies, no, come oh, on. Oh yeah, yeah, of course. There's a little winky face out there. Oh jeez. Um, no, when I was like, yeah, when. What happened? Oh my god, that's... It was it bad. sounds like such a fucking nightmare. Like, it was so I, bad. So I did not think this video was going to turn out like that. I love that. Well, listen, like, okay, you're seven. No, I was, how old was I? I was like, I was in, I was in grade two. So I, yeah, I would have been like seven or eight, somewhere in there, right? So, you like, your little dick, it gets hit so fucking bad with an Indian rubber ball from like a fucking kid who's two years older than you with like just wailing on it on the cross again. It's like a bounce pass. So it's got like the, all the fucking tension to go right in, right into it, right? So it, it, it swelled my dick so bad that it actually like broke part of my urethra is essentially what happened. So I had to get a catheter put in to fix my urethra so it didn't like seal close. How did you ever turn out to be like a normal human? It sucked. I'm not going like to lie. That, that, that sounds really bad. It man. was I'm, fucking rough. Like, I'm, I'm being perfect. I broke like, my dick. I, I broke I, I, my I dick. I joke around all the time, man. Like, I'm, I'm like a fucking clown. But, like, man, I'm being very serious right now. That sounds really bad. Like, I, like that sounds like a really traumatic kind of thing to go through. I mean, no. Like, I mean, it's... A, you, have, you have to, like, literally use a catheter to pee for months on yeah. end? No, it was... I, that I, is insane. Like, yeah. what the fuck? Really? Catheters are, like, you know, usually, like... It's what they used to hold for um, elderly people or for like acute like No uh, man, like if you have a dick injury, like a bad one, like you're gonna use a catheter. Oh my so God. like that is just the worst sounding thing. I mean So like, I probably shouldn't post this then, eh? No, I don't, I don't give a shit. <laughs> okay. Does it look like Plus I can? What? Well, you're oh, drinking are, are right you now, so I was going to you. I am. Can you not see the oh, thing going? Oh, my God. I, I did not even realize the entire time. Uh, <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't notice. What the fuck? Like, we're, like I, I had no idea. I know this um, like five, five, ten minutes ago. Really? Oh, well, I, I genuinely had no we, idea. We've been drinking. 
I, I no, you can post it. I don't care, man. I'll ask you in the morning when you're when no, you're fine. sober. No, no, yeah. honestly, no, I'll be fine when I'm sober. I'm like not yeah. drunk. I mean, it's a he's great fine. story, but like, I don't know how how you're cool with it now, and I don't know if you be cool with it later. No, no, he'll be fine. cool. Like, I can already tell Tozer's not the kind of guy to fucking you know like waffle on that shit. Like, I mean, well, he's not drunk. Said, I don't give a shit. We're not wasted right now. We're just like buzzed and having a good time, kind nope. of thing. But like men, I'm sweating. Sir, that I'm, really I'm, sucks. I'm sweating. Yeah, I am, I'm I sweating like a like motherfucker really right now, though. Well, All right, well, let's go outside for a second. Yeah, I need a cigarette. Well, guys, next time on Terror Time, we'll talk more about sounding. How about that? All right, see you guys. Derek learned something new. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my, oh my god. god. I can't believe that. I'm still mind blown. That's amazing. That. Months of, of catheter usage is not normal. No, it's like, it, that is, that is so far At first, from the norm. it sucks. Like, it really sucks no. at first, but then it's just part of like your daily people, routine. Like, like, elderly people do that, and like, fucking. My grandmother had people that, do that. Like, she had surgery for like a month. Oh man, That's like, a, that is not normal. That Like, for like a young, like, adult male to, to go through that, that is not normal. That is. You, you are the 1%, man. Like, I guarantee you. Those are your chances.